the sing this Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're here for the first time, I'm Joycelyn Binui and I'm a content creator based in Luala, Cameroon. Please do well to hit the subscribe button and turn on your notification bell so that once any new video comes in, you get a notification and you watch. Yeah, so guys, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a back to school haul. You guys, this economy this time around is not the best at all things are so expensive and uh, you go to the market with so much money but you get to buy just a little so you guys i did not even go to be buying a lot like i just bought what the children really need i just bought what the kids really need yeah so i'm going to be showing you the few things that i bought sorry i couldn't carry you guys along to the market you guys because markets in douala at this time and if you joke with your camera or with your phone you're going to say a goodbye forever to it, yeah. So I didn't want that to happen. So I, in order to avoid that, I didn't film in the market. And some of their things that they used last year, they are going to continue with that this year. Yeah, so let me start with the school bags. This is Ngumi school bag. Since she's in elementary school, she doesn't carry books to school. Their books stay at school. So this bag, she needs it only to put her food and her snacks inside, yeah. I love the bag. I love the colors, the purple. The baby blue and the yellow i love the colors and the back is strong it's solid and okay for her the size is just okay for her. yeah so i have some other things inside the back okay i'm just going to be showing their things because I, I put all their things together inside each person's bag yeah so this is her water bottle i bought her this pink water bottle you guys i didn't want to go for these other water bottles that uh, have a straw because what I experienced last year with that straw water bottle, I don't want any straw water bottle again. That's usually hide inside that straw and when, during cleaning, they don't really take time to clean that straw inside often. Yeah, as often as they should. So I decided to go with this water bottle. So she, she's just going to open it like this, drink, and it's easy to wash. Yeah, with a brush. I just wash it like that. It's easy. So I decided to go with this simple one. I cannot even remember the prices of this thing, you guys. Please pardon me. I'm not good at remembering prices and saying the prices on my videos. And then next is her umbrella. You see the color of her umbrella goes with the color of her bag. I intended to get my intention was to get her purple, you guys. That thing has been so much there. Yeah. So I decided to get her purple. I couldn't get a purple water bottle for her. I should have. And then these are her shoes. These are her school shoes. I love this her shoes so much. So it has this rope so that it's going to hold her leg. And this one, she has two shoes. Yeah, so Ngumis has two shoes. This is the other one. She's going to be using these two. They look almost the same. Yeah. Sorry, as I said, I can't remember the prices. And then this is her, this is her raincoat. Yeah, it's still inside the pack, but I've removed it. Yeah, so let me, and then next are her boots. These are her rain boots, you guys. I really love this rain boots. I love the color, the pink and the purple. Again, I told you guys, I really wanted purple for her this year. And then these rain boots, I love them because they have this soft thing inside. Yeah, so these are her rain boots. And yeah, the next, you guys, she went on holidays. One of my friends came and took her for holidays. She was there for um, close to two weeks. So on coming back, she bought her this nice school bag, you guys. I love the bag so much. The bag is so nice and it's big. I think it's even big. Maybe she's going to use this when she's in class one day. That's what I'm thinking because she doesn't have any books to be put inside this big bag. The bag is so nice, yeah, and it's large, solid. It has two compartments two large compartments i think she's going to i'm just going to package this one and keep it and she's going to use it in class one because even her school bag of last year is still good I, last year i bought her two school bags she got to use only one and the other one maybe i'm just going to keep it like a reserve is in if in case she wets her bag or anything during the week we can always switch to the other one but for this one i'm just going to package it and keep it she's going to use it next year in class one if you don't know you guys I'm talking about my daughter. Ngumis is my daughter and she is in nursery school. She is going to nursery 2 this year. She will be attending nursery 2 this year. So she doesn't need a lot to put in her bag. Yeah, the only thing she puts in her bag is her food. Yeah, and her water. So I don't even, I never even bother about getting her a lunch bag or anything. Next, we come... Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, 
Next, let me finish with the bags first. I still have some other stuff for me. Let's come with the bags. Let's come to EJ. So this is EJ's school bag. I love this his bag so much, you guys. The bag is so solid, like I love the bag. It has this pinning thing, and he really loves it. He loves when he carries his bag on the back and then he pins this thing in front. <laughs> you know how kids are. Yeah, so this is the bag. It has this handle. I love the bag is so solid, you guys. And it has many compartments where he can put his books. You guys, the quantity of books that children primary school children carry to school in this age were not the quantity of books we used to carry in our age you guys in our years back 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 when we we're still very young this is not the quantity of books we used to carry the quantity of books that primary school children carry to school i just wonder and i wonder and they end up using all the books they maybe because the subjects that they are studying have increased maybe yeah so they carry a lot of books to school so this is imagine this is a class two kids back this last year so i'm just going to show you guys what is inside i really love the bag i love the bag yeah and i was going for red and black for ej that was so for ej here we have his water bottle is the same kind of water bottle like gumi's own like this no straw easy to open and wash yeah And next we have his lunch bag. EJ is in class two. That's my son. He's in class two. He's, that's he'll be attending class two this year. So this is his lunch bag, and he loves Spider-Man so much. When I brought this lunch bag, he was so happy. Like, yeah. So I love the lunch bag. He's so spacious. He can have his lunch bowl and his what? He can carry his lunch bowl and water bottle at the same time. And then he has this thing that even if water pours in here, it's not going to wet the back, and you can just use a cloth, thin cloth to wipe it. Yeah, so that is it. And he has two zips that even if one gets bad, you can always use the other one. I really love the lunch bag. You guys, all these things you're seeing me showing for EJ are the same things for Jason. That's Jason, my nephew. We bought the same things, but since his mom has already packed his own things in their room i couldn't go and then start removing it because i want to do a haul i just had to do with these ones that i'm seeing so i'm doing a haul only for gummies and ej i also have my sister-in-law in boya's kids here i also bought school things for them and I'm, I'm not going to be showing all of that you guys yeah so there are things are in their room i'm just going to be showing only for ej and gummies because i have them around me here yeah so inside this is bag this is own umbrella also this is EJ's umbrella. It's blue, black in color. You know the rain. The rain that is falling in Douala this year. Every day is a rainy day in Douala. So I decided to get them um, a raincoat also. I decided to get all of them rain. We got all of them raincoats. I went. I did all this shopping with my sister. Yeah, we went to the market together. And this is EJ's own raincoat. And uh, his boots. His boots are outside. <laughs> I didn't come with the boots. Let me keep the bag. Let's go to let's go to EJ's shoes. These are EJ's school shoes, and they and they wear only black shoes to school. You guys, that's why you see mostly black shoes here. Yeah, these are EJ's shoes. I love his shoes so much. I really love them. Boots and affordable shoes for school. Yeah. So this is one of his shoes. This is one of his shoes, and. Um, this is the next one. This is the next one. Yeah, so this is his next pair of shoes, black. And then here they also have tennis, you guys, for sports. And on days where they are going to be wearing their t shirt and jeans, they are going to be wearing it with tennis. These are his tennis shoes for sports and if they are when they are wearing jeans they have other shoes you guys these are just the new ones i bought especially gummies i don't even know why when i was buying shoes from gummy because gum has shoes her shoe drawer is already full a big drawer is already full with shoes she has a lot of shoes yeah but since if you buy for one person and you don't buy for the other they are, it's, it's going to cause a problem yeah so because one person cannot be having a new thing you know how kids are when you have multiple kids yeah so one person cannot be having a new thing when the other person is not having yeah, so these are um, Gumi's own tennis. These are her tennis for sports also. Yeah, and I really love them. They are easy to clean. They have this smooth back. Very easy to clean. Yeah, and then next we have 
Next, we have their underwear. I bought them. I usually buy white innerwears for my kids, you guys. Oh, yeah, innerwears are always white in color. I bought since they already have some that they are still going to be using that are still very good. We always take time to clean them. Yeah, so they are. You see this color as it's like this. From next year, you're going to see this innerwear with this same color. It's not going, going to change. We take our time to clean them and we know how they use them. They don't just use them anyhow. So I bought three innerwears from Gumis. These are three innerwears. Female innerwears. And uh, three also for EJ. Three also for EJ. These are the male innerwears. That's one, two, three for EJ. And also there are boxers. What, be, what he'll be wearing to school. His pants. I bought him one, two, three, four. Let me see one, two, three, four, five, six boxers and one panty, male pants. I love the boxers. They are so cute. Male boxers. They are cute. Yeah. And they loved all their things. And then next, I got some pants from Gummies. Gummies, gummies. These are gummies pants. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I've got five pants from gummies. And gummies has a lot of pants, you guys. That's why I didn't want to get her more pants. People keep gifting gummies like and gummies is always receiving gifts, you guys. This is my daughter is so blessed. <laughs> And then these other pants, this other set of pants are the pants that my friend, when she went for holidays, my friend came and took her for holidays, bought her these pants. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. Six pants. And they are so cute. So nice, yeah. So all of these are Gumi's pants. So in total, she's going to have like 12 pants. Yeah, so that is it, guys. And then next are their socks. The socks that they are going to be wearing to school. The other ones of last year, we're just going to pack them and throw them because they are already expanded with all the washing and washing and ironing. You guys, I wash and iron my kids' things from <laughs> like everything. Yeah, in order to avoid any skin complications or skin anything. Yeah, so I just want to do a quick haul of these uh, things that I bought so that they are going to get them washed and ironed and they are ready for school. Yeah, so these are their socks. I don't worry myself go getting serious serious so because these things i get them and they wear only for one year and we change them and we are good to go yeah so this is another one from gummies they are just going to share all of this about the same almost the same size but this one's a little bit smaller so gummies is going to be using this one and i still need to get her these other socks that have the decoration this cha, -cha socks that's how we call them <laughs> these other socks that have the decoration right i still need to get them so that she could wear them with her with this her uh, shoes with her for these other socks she's going to be using them with the tennis she can wear these ones with the tennis but for these other shoes she's going to be needing those other socks that have the decoration to wear with them yeah so that is it guys the only thing left are ej's own uh, boots i sent them outside so they are outside right now and uh, the the next thing we need to get are their books we still need to go and buy their books but for that one it's not going to be any problem we're just going to pick it up very fast we have been so busy during this time like we have really been so busy so we just create time to get these things the main things have already been bought and the only thing left now are the books that we are going to write the names on and put them in their bags and then for my girls my big girls, that's blessing and joy. They are big girls already. I gave them money and they went and did their shopping by themselves, you guys. Yeah. So since December last year, I decided that I'm not going to stress to be buying things for them. They're already big. They have shown them the market. They know where to get what. So when time comes, I just ask them to write their list and I give them the money I estimate. And I give them the money and they go and buy their things by themselves. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And for Jason's own things, as I said before, they are in their room. Her mom, his, his mom has already put them together, so I cannot go and touch them to show you guys. So I have to show these ones that have not yet been arranged or have not yet been washed. I also got some new school uniforms for them this year. I wanted to add their uniforms. You guys, I always like to get things in a way, when you see me getting these things like this, maybe somebody's going to see and think that there are many No, As I'm a working mom, in order to minimize time this is what i do this year this is what i'm planning especially now that i'm having a baby you guys it's not easy i have to do their things i have to arrange their things in such a way that 
they wear their uniforms. I want because they wear during the week in five days they wear uni they are going to be wearing uniforms for three days and they are going to be wearing their jean and their school t shirt one day and their sport wear on the fifth day. Yeah, so I want in such a way that they are going to have three school uniforms, they are going to have their jean and t shirt and they are going to have their sport wear also, such that they can wear it for the whole week and the, and we're only going to wash only during the weekend all the laundry is going to be done during the weekend because before when they come back from school they usually wash their uniforms they get their uniforms washed and dried so that by the next that's like two days after they are going to repeat the uniform again but this year since there is a baby i don't want the person who stays with the baby to get so stressed of uh, wash uniforms here and there so i want that they have three school uniforms that they are going to be wearing they have their jean and t-shirt that they are going to be wearing and also their sport wear so we get to wash only over the weekends and even these inner wears they are in a way that they have other inner wears that they are going to add to this so they are going to just wear everything and then wash everything during the weekend when everybody is in the house yeah to assist and all of that so that is how we're going to be functioning that's why you see these things right here yeah so thank you guys if you have watched up to this point thank you so much and if you haven't yet subscribed do me well to hit the subscribe button down there and turn on your notification bell so that once any new video comes in you get a notification and you watch thank you so much and see you guys in my next one Bye bye <laughs>